Introducing the Org Chart Platform, that allows us to build the most flexible and customizable org charts from our data and easily integrate into our website. Step 1. Visit orgchart.hexviz.com and we can immediately see a sample org chart. Data link shows the source dataset in CSV or JSON format. If we want to see different designs, click, try different org charts, and choose one of your liking. Okay, let's learn how we can customize it. Open the link spreadsheet by clicking the data link. First, let's replace the default data with our own. For that make a copy. Then publish in CSV format. Finally, copy-paste the link into data link input. JSON file can also be used. Now, the org chart is built out of our spreadsheet dataset. Let's open advanced settings, and play with some of the customization features. Since the URL for CSV and spreadsheet is different, it will be good if we also copy spreadsheet URL into data name field, so that we can easily access it anytime. We can play with sliders to customize dimensions and spacing for org charts. We can change between compact and more traditional org chart layout and also define behavior if the chart should move when expanding or collapsing nodes. Now the most important part. If we know a bit of HTML, we can drastically customize org chart nodes and add or remove any information from nodes. In order to display fields from our data, use column names in curly braces and modify HTML in advanced settings. So, suppose I wanted to add last name column from the data and make nodes pink color. As we can see in the spreadsheet data, we have last name field. Let's use it in org chart. For that we just need to wrap it in curly braces. Now we can see last names. Finally, we can import and export our state in order to save all the changes we made. It's useful if we want to do additional changes in the future and don't want to lose progress. Once we are done with modifications, click the Embed iframe, copy the code and paste to your website. Let's use realtimehtml.com for testing the code.
Code on the left, result on the right. That's it, we can now update the data in the copied spreadsheet, and org chart will automatically update on our website. If we just want to mess around with portal and data, choose simple theme, and start modifying data in spreadsheet without making a copy. It will automatically restore initial dataset in every hour. On average, spreadsheet needs 10 to 20 seconds to update the shared data, but it might take up to 5 to 10 minutes to settle, since spreadsheet sometimes loads the old data. Keep clicking the refresh button and checking the time to see if the data was updated, although it's recommended to fill the data first, and only then make changes in org chart portal. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions feel free to comment under the video or under the issues of open source org chart repository.